the they new did wooden buy the house. Like. They yes. did. Very yes. excited for that collaboration between six and eight. It's pretty awesome. Yep. And then over here is District 23, which we're so proud of. They uh, raised money for cochlear implants, and they just had the latest bites on the boulevard, which was a spectacular success. Fabulous. Yes. And they have great clothes. And they have great clothes, jewelry, <laughs> candles. I mean, what do you want? I think all of the above. I'm turning onto Williams Boulevard because it is in Washington Park. It's a beautiful street. And we've got some trees turning. We do have some lovely fall color upon us. Love it. Fun fact, the yes. park district maintains the road, not the city. I did not know that. I know, you learn something new every day. This is fabulous. They probably need to get over here. I thought you would appreciate it. <laughs> and here we have our lovely walnut. <gasps> the spectacular new walnut. Oh, it's like driving on butter. Uh, it is like driving on glass. <laughs> I mean, I this can't think gorgeous. of anything more fun. This is gorgeous. We've And it took how long, Kristen? Two years. Two years. A lot of complaining, bike lanes. It's glorious. Correct? Well, the, it is. It is. And that's one of the things that we need more of in this city is accessibility and transportation that doesn't always absolutely require you to have a car. Look at this fancy bike lane. Oh, so fancy. Cutting right to the, the middle. middle. So love it. Yes. And then up here, the legendary Mellow Cream Donuts. We both have Mellow Creams. And I think probably every ward should have Oh, their own sure. mellow cream. Absolutely. My children will not eat any other donut. Well, they will eat other donuts, but there's a protest They're not and an good. asterisk next to it. Absolutely. But do you have a Gabatonis? I do not have a Gabatonis. Hey, I didn't think so. I don't have a Track Shack either. Oh, the best fried chicken in town. <laughs> Thursday nights, pie or some spe spectacular dessert made by uh, my friend Carlene, who I went to high school with. So I'm going to go by one of my other Another big kind of thing that's happened in Ward 6 as of late, which is Isles nice. Park. But you've had a lot happening with the railroad. <clears throat> oh, are we going to bring on? up the railroad? I would. I didn't bring it up. I think oh, I my gosh. Uh oh. No. No, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> the railroad I is love fine. love these underpasses. I know. They're brand spanking love new and them. amazing. And they're going to be everywhere. They're everywhere. It's so easy to get across town. It is. But we have a skate park now in Ward 6. I know. I mean, this is what the one is I would be jealous skate park. of. Yes. Well, the playground equipment over here looks fabulous. It's brand new. The lighting is really, really good. This is Isles Park now. We just went through Grand Central. That's where Mellow Cream is. And now we're heading over into Isles Park. Nice. Um, and now, do you still have the pickleball in Isles Park? Yes, of course. Pickle and do you play? I do not play. Mm. Um, friends of mine play. I know a lot of people who do play. I've always wanted to try it. No, Arrow, what's going on here? Ugh, you need to get on that. Call I the know. City about this. Call the city. Where's my left arrow? Right turn now. Arrow? Where's the arrow? I'm calling my older woman. Okay. Believe me. Hey, oh. turning in front of traffic? Who? You? Me? <laughs> no. I'm waiting my turn. I Almost. Think, ah! I think kidding. your dad was driver's ed teacher. You're not supposed to turn the wheel before you go into the. Oh, stop it. Oh, you think yeah. I pay attention to what he says? I'm sure you did. That's Look right. at that playground equipment. I know. It's spectacular. It's so, really, really nice. But what else are they doing here? Is this all for the trails? Look at in? the trail they're putting oh, in. Look at that. Is that spectacular? Love it. Yes. So this has always been a park because my kids went to Isles grade school. Mm -hmm. And so we would come to this park sometimes, you know, after school, just as a break and it's just to see it this nice is it's so nice so i was just gorgeous. here for a neighborhood association meeting a few weeks ago and this was not done actually last monday fabulous. night i know two mondays ago love it so and those are, are very high excited speed about that. rails over there there's the rail line correct and here is the skate park <gasps> look at that oh yeah Hang we on. need to get some graffiti artists in here though i would think so i mean some good ones yeah look at it it These guys are getting fabulous. ready to shred. <laughs> yes. Were you a skater girl? I was totally a skater I was girl. So a skater girl in the 80s. I still have my vans. <laughs> Love that skate park. They are assessing their options. They are. They are setting up their plan. I love it. So we're going to go past my, probably my all-time favorite Ward 6 business. 
Well, there's two up here. I'm there's George s- Ranks, the yes. round bar, where the- I used to do a lot of karaoke in my youth. We're not doing karaoke on this drive. Well, we, c- we could. No, I just said we're not. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> you don't want me kick breaking the windows. I would your love car. to do some karaoke. Um, but yeah, the round bar, as I call it. It's a lot of fun in there. Tom Irwin plays in there a lot, doesn't he? Yes. Yeah. A lot of local music all the time. It's fun. Very nice. Now, I will give you $100 if your next favorite business is not one of my favorite Ward at Six businesses. You know what it is. Of course I do. I mean, this... I've got the stickers. I've got the Me books. too. I've got the t-shirts. I've got I've the I've got prints. multiple t-shirts. Yes. Yes. So we're talking there about... the original... Grab a Java. Grab a Java on 6th Street. It's the best. I mean, it literally... I, I credit it for getting me through, you know, opening a business, closing a business... Um, children, children, marriage, jobs, engagement, divorce, everything, everything. Now this is a um, Hisso Music is also a oh, pretty nice. yeah. It's really cool. He has a recording studio in there. Um, he does a a lot, a lot locally. You know, tries to get people involved. He holds, you know, kind of. Um, he did a few giveaways during COVID. He's a really good guy. It's nice. Yes, it is nice. Our local businesses, we are, I will say we are very fortunate with the the business community in this town. It is. We, we are. We some wonderful, wonderful people. We do. So we are now in Harvard Park. Hello, Harvard Park. And this is a very active neighborhood, a very vocal neighborhood. Yes, I know that. Home to the one and only Polly Poskin. I've met Polly Poskin once you or twice. You know Polly Poskin? I have met her. Okay. Yeah. All right. I think we're friends. Well, we have our I'm meetings here sir. at the Harvard Park Baptist Church. So this is kind of the hub for the neighborhood. It's um, a nice hug. And they're having a trunk or treat. Yes. Good. And this is... And the food pantry. Oh, yes. And the food pantry. Very, very... I, I'd probably give the most to that one. Um... But I love this neighborhood, and you know the residents are very, very passionate about their neighborhood. And I love their passion, and I love that they are vocal, and I also love that they just care about where they live. And they really care about where they live. They really do, and you can see that. I mean, you can see these are... It's such a cute, cute neighborhood. Little, yeah, yes. Cute houses, people are maintaining them. Uh-huh. Oh, what's going on back in there? Their house. Uh huh. Yep, I think that was an icon meeting. Oh, what? Time. Yes. Years ago. Uh huh. I think you're right because I think I know who owns that house too. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to be the rail yard. We're going to turn here. So this is where we're going to have the our containers, cars, our container shop. Yes. Can't wait for that. Look, they're they're getting it. It's they have some containers so back there already. I know it's going to be awesome. <laughs> so we're going to go up here on Stanford. Now, we've talked about how Station House, Firehouse Number 6 needs to move. Yes, let's and go see where it is. They're in Harvard Park. Well, I don't think this is where it's going oh, you don't to be. Want to... Oh, okay. But this is it's going to be somewhere in the vicinity of Stanford. And I think that one probably is a little bit more pressing than Station House 8. Well, I mean, it's pressing, but... Yeah, I think it's a little bit more. I don't, um, you know, I don't want to say it's, it's more more pressing but it's I mean it's definitely it's boxed in it's boxed in yes and I would have driven past it but it's hard to get out I don't want to do that no we don't want to do that so we're going to drive down here because I want to take you out to Shields because we have a big project coming to Shields we do what do we have coming to Shields well we have the Legacy Point Sports Complex I and we got some good news on it today but I can't say what it is (laughs) oh I'm it's excited for that. Even as a single mom with not much money, I spent so much on travel soccer with my kids. Yeah. I mean, it's that's such a that's a game changer addition to the city. It's going to be really cool. It's going to be really cool. Mm-hmm. I'm excited for it. And we're also coming up on the world famous, world famous Darcy's, Darcy's Pint. Pint. I mean. <laughs> I took my niece and nephew from, they live in Boston. We took them there for um, horseshoes. First of all, I told them, order pony shoes. They were not very big. They were younger children back then. Yeah. And it was, as as my niece said, game, uh, not game, a life-changing Oh, well, if you do it right. 
Yeah. I had a boyfriend move here from California, and the first few months, he's like, I'm not eating that. That looks disgusting. <laughs> and then he wanted one every day. Once, once you try it, yes. you cannot deny it. No. Because Darcy's used to be over in town and country. The original yes, Darcy's. Yes, they did. Yes. And then Dub the original Dublin pub was over there, too. That is not Ward 6. That's Ward 7. I know. Very confusing. And yet... Makes sense. Yes. So you've had a fair amount of development out this way, though. I mean, if you think about it. Yeah, I mean, got, between the... You know, this little area here is building up. Correct. And, and this helps. over here... Yep. ...is eventually supposed to connect, because um, this is Lincolnshire Boulevard up here. Which needs to go through. Which needs to go through. We, yep. I, I have to point out, also, we are next to a sign company truck over here. That's a great Ward 6 business hey, as well. Hey, sign... Yeah. He's not waving at he us. He doesn't care. <laughs> no. He's, he are. wants to know what these cameras are all about. I know, he's probably concerned about that. He's like, who are these famous ladies next to me? Well, speaking of famous, because they, they put in all of the bus benches. Yes, they do all the bus benches and the advertising for the bus benches. Yes, well, that's the big part, isn't of it? Of course. <laughs> of course it is. Okay, so again, things I love about Ward 6, biking on this bike trail. I mean, and that picks oh, up so yeah. many different wards, but... We have great really options stuff. for exercise in Springfield. We, we do. Just get outside. They're, and they're getting better and better. And that's a huge thing. It is. This is all to be developed. As all part of this in here. Yes. Yep. A lot of land. A lot of land, a lot of fields. Yes. And we're going to do this whole little um, messed up parking lot of shields. They did get creative here. Oh. And a lot of opportunities for new businesses to come in. There is there is a, a lot of opportunity over there. It'd be a great location. Yes. Well, and it's got to be a really great location. Yes, it is. And here we've got our COVID testing. Or Absolutely. these vaccinations. And look at this. We've got a hotel here. Brand new hotel. Ready it's beautiful. For the fields. We have electric charging stations over there. I know. I love it. And... The Quaker Steak and Lube was just bought. Oh, who bought it? Do we know? Um, I'm not sure who bought it or what they're going to do with it, but they're going to do something with it. Well, I'm excited and ingrained. And we have ingrained over here, which, you know, I really respect these businesses that came out here and thought they were going to have, you know, this big mall, outlet mall built. And I mean, he, they they've took a really stuck with it. And I'll tell you what, they do great food in there. They really do. Good beer. Yes, it's really good, good stuff. Beer. It's good stuff. Yeah. So this is all more, more, more fields. See it? If you and build it, the they bike, will come. And the bike trail will stay. Yes, bike trail is staying. So that's a good thing. Yes. Five. Yeah, you know, ingrained is one of my favorite places to go out to eat. It's it's really it good really stuff. It really is. And they always have a you best know, appetizer. They do. Oh and they, my gosh. They change it up all the time. Yeah, they do. So thank Hello, you, ingrained. ingrained. Yes. So now we're going to head back Lovely down. Lovely outdoor eating options. It is. It's nice. It's nice to sit outside there. So that's all I planned on showing in Ward 6. 